Okay, I'm doing my house tour a little bit out of order because people are wondering why I have the Patreon and the PayPal. And this is the real reason. Um, this was the area my mom was going to help us with. This room needs to be totally gutted. I know everybody says they love the kitchen and everything, but um, let's really get into this. Okay, um, over here. We have this nice pretty bay window, but outside they didn't do the roof part of it correctly, and we need to redo that. Um, this is the only window I fibbed the other day. This is the only window that is not broke. Unfortunately, it does not open. We got to figure out how to open it. I think it's painted completely shut with like 15,000 layers of paint. But uh, that's our pretty bay window we have. Um, so this area is okay. Um, this wall we are planning on taking out because it was never meant to be here. It is um, sheetrock and um, it wasn't built right. And it makes the kitchen extremely small. So... Um, we go over here, and um, this is our stove area. Um, it, it doesn't quite fit in right, because um, nothing in this kitchen is right. Um, our cabinets are metal. Um, and as you see, there's giant holes, because there used to be a ventilation system. And we have a giant hole there, so things like to fall. We have a gas stove, things catch on fire. Yeah, it's a bad situation there. Um, need a lot of electrical work because that is the only plug-in we have on this wall. My husband is an electrician, but wiring is not cheap. So we have the microwave crammed in there next to our refrigerator, which we need a new one really bad. It leaks water constantly. And that's a whole different story. Okay, every pipe in this house busted after the people moved out of it. We've had to replace every pipe in the house. The bathroom upstairs straddles this room and the laundry room, which is on the other side of this wall. Which means, this is the infamous where the cat fell through. All of this is rotted up here. All the lath, all the plaster, it falls continuously. We have to tear this all out. The only thing that's up here is paneling, meaning we have to tear this all out and sheetrock it. Um, we're going to tear it out to the to the studs and re sheetrock it all. Um, we have to tear out all this drop ceiling, get rid of all these lighting fixtures. Um, I'm sure there's mold up here. As you can tell, the ceiling is in really, really bad shape, but we can't tear it out until we have a way to do something up there because there's all exposed pipe up here. <coughs> um, yeah, it's, it's really, really, really bad. This has all been soaked with water forever and ever and ever. After we moved here, we had issues with it. It's just in really bad shape. This is a doorway that's supposed to lead to the other room that they closed off that um, they threw in these stupid metal um, metal um, cabinets that are literally falling apart. Um, these doors we have to put back on at least twice a week. Um, yeah, I have dishes soaking in my sink. Uh, we're normal people. Um, see, the they don't even match. I mean, it'd be one thing, but they don't even... Like, they got wood up to metal, and there's just no storage space whatsoever. Um, the sink is broken. The drains are broken. The sprayer is broken. We cannot use a sprayer. It has an old um, water softener system that we have to take completely out. We have to take the dishwasher, which was brand new and had never been used. 
We had to take it completely out because it is actually plugged in using an extension cord, which everything was plugged in in this house using an extension cord. And mind you, we have this plug in and we have that plug in. That's the only plug ins we have along this whole area. <coughs> this is the extent of our kitchen usage. Then we get down to the floor. Because of all the leakage, we have this happening. So we are going to have to tear up the entire floor. And I don't know what we're going to find underneath there in the laundry room. We're not finding good stuff at all. So, um, yeah, this is why I have the GoFundMe. Um, because this was the major room my mom was going to help me with. And, uh, this is a serious situation. This is going to be a lot of money up here. Totally. A lot of money. I mean, I don't want a $15,000 kitchen or anything, but, um, yeah, this was an old cabinet that was sitting. I don't even know where they put a stove in this because this was where the stove was. Um, so, yeah, um, we need to do something. My husband has rewired all of the wiring so the house don't burn down. Except for this. Um, he's going to rewire this. We have to buy a new air conditioner. We don't have no air conditioner for downstairs. So, um, yeah. This is the kitchen. And the sad, moldy state that it's in. So that's why I have a Patreon and a PayPal. Thanks for watching.